welcome back to Biomute. My name is Usser. Apparently we need to go meet the war party. It says so. Right on the screen. Uh-oh. Oh, they're tough. Shot. Hey, nice shot. Okay, hitting an enemy with a special attack fills one of the Super Wung Fu icons to the left of your character. When they're all filled, you can activate the Super Wung Fu state. Oh, you need to use a different special attack to fill it up. Not sure if I'm doing it right. I got bio points though. I thought that guy was gonna have something for me to loot. Um, it tells me to go places, but one man's trash, another man's treasure. Here we go. Okay. What do we have? <laughs> The Automaton Trail. Examine the notice. That notice okay. book, filled with the leftovers of used to be once. You're getting close to one of those old toxinol brick towns. Pay attention. All right. The Toxinol Corporation made this place, and then just threw it away when they were done with it. They threw away whole cities? Well, small ones. I didn't Places realize like the automaton was back the narrator. The days, and there was plenty of space. Get done with one place, you just build another. There must be a track somewhere in this brick town. Just hope it's not buried. Wow. One of 15 notice for. I don't want that as my... Ah, there we go. Meet the war party. Yes. Plated pants. Alright, well, what those? Better than nothing. Yeah, but it's one of those on its situations way. where it looks ridiculous, but I'm doing it because it's the better stats. Good thing I still have my crowbar. Hey, vending machine. Alright. Why was there a coat in the vending machine? Whatever. I'm putting it on. Oh, it's way better. Oh, I gotta gain a level first. Damn. What do we got here? Med kits. An add-on. Okay. Well, we'll continue looting and looking. Oh, hey. We're out of the subway. Let's look around. This corner of the world is called Bricktown. Okay. Open up the map to see the area objectives again. Old world knowledge right there. Okay, so there's nothing in Bricktown. I should turn around and go the other direction. However, I haven't looted Bricktown yet. You know what, let's ignore Bricktown for now. I can do that in between episodes, come through and loot everything and make weapons and armor. Let's be on our way. The darkness swallows everything at night. 
you found the whereabouts. The deepest, darkest forest in the land. Sometimes hard to see for all the trees. Right. Ow! Hey! Dead! Where is he? There he is. Get back here! something I don't know all right so I gotta help the guys with the like the turbans on their heads those are my friends all right I didn't pick sides last time because I had met That's the actual Sifu here Let's use the map. Okay, so I am supposed to go here. The Myriad Tribe, meet the war party. Yeah, I didn't realize my little grasshopper was the narrator. That's cool. Uh. Tribe war begins. Oh, uh -huh. what do we have here? That looks cool. Found a biocontaminated col container. Collect these bio blobs and unlock mutations in the menus. Or just change your appearance. Ooh. Yeah, that's just awful. Watch your step around here. Four bio points. Nice. Backpack. That's for my back. I wonder if I can put it on right now. And does that give me more room in my inventory? Or so face. Left shoulder. Back! Aha, backpack. Uh. I don't really say anything. Let's equip it. Oh, yeah. I look like a scavenger. Just wearing whatever. Uh, before I get carried away meaning the war party, I should look at mutations, because I have my... Bio points. Uh, biogenetics. Yeah, biogenetics. Okay, so... I don't think I want one that's an up-close one. We might as well do the... Ooh, what's fungi? Oh, it allows me to bounce over things. That yeah, let's let's vomit Something acid at people. Happen to you. Uh, square. All right, we're gonna we're gonna vomit. Oh, it goes in a line. Cool. Yuck. <laughs> Shit, dude. Will it reload you? Says it's time to set the outpost free. Inflict as little damage as possible as you make your way through to the rival captain. Captain, huh? Mm, you can, you... If you can, you should try to convince the captain to give up the outpost and join your cause. Okay. Well, let's go. The, the suck. They're ready to enter the outpost when you are. The Erds are in our favor. I don't know that they actually are. Every we got two guys. Towards your end goal will bring you closer to a better world. 
What if it doesn't? So we're going to have to make a new the first line of defense. door once we finish. They look like samurai. a bomb lobber. <laughs> Can I like hit these back at it? That's the wrong way. Okay, now see it's giving me um I have to time it just right, but now it's giving me There we go. That twirly wheel works that drain pipe. Okay. It wasn't popping up the squares. And there's a delay, like I always mentioned. So... Spin the twirly wheel and open that drain. Oh, I went the wrong way. Completed. I had two moves left. Everything's clocking together. Is it? I don't swim well. Could be this key. Keep going. Okay, guys. Help me out here. That cage is holding a helper. Ooh. This is very similar to, like, Ghost of Tsushima, now that I'm thinking about it. It's very kind of a similar, except I'm not sneaking and assassinating people. Nailed it. Oh, hold on, loop first, loop first. What's up, man? Uh, where? I saw it. There it is. I never lost hope you'd come, but weren't sure if they'd last long enough to see it. Says the tribe's been hard on them. Return to the fort and Want rest. Want revenge on those who caged them, but trust you'll take care of it. Yeah. Yeah, I'll take care of it, man. New main quest, the armory. Aura is somewhat light. What do we have here? A new gun. The Extermino Frog Rapster. What? Equip it. What kind of a name? Oh my god, look at all these guns. Guys, why are you only letting me have one? Look at the swords! We need the key to the armory. Wow, it holds a lot of bullets. A sharpshooter. The scaffolding looks unstable. Okay. Well, let's go full speed. Better stay clear of the red ray. Here's the second line of defense. Yeah, but but No! I thought it- I thought it looked unstable. Okay, guess not. It- it's not very accurate. Oh, I love that wicked wolf attack. Uh oh, <laughs> his face looks ridiculous with that on. <laughs> T 
timber. Let a big bump be done. Ouch. 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 Oof. Switched off the light. A barrel shoot. Yeah. Smack it to get a barrel out of it. Then hit it toward the gate and blast it. Okay. That looks slowly. Shoot it and watch it blow. Not too close. Kaboom. You're in. <laughs> nice. Almost there. That is, that is pretty cool, actually. The outpost belongs to your tribe now. Hmm. Okay, so wait. Was the captain the big you guy? made them weaker, but they won't give up. Your Sifu thanks you. Your tribe is growing stronger. Okay. Was the big guy the captain? Because, like, he did not give me a single chance to, uh... Talk to him or anything. I had to use him to take down the sniper. Does he really have to be paraded around on that thing? Tribal weapon unlocked. The boomerang. You defeat a rival tribe, you acquire its weapon. By helping your own tribe, you've acquired its weapon. Now allied with a tribe, you can decide to switch your allegiance and ally with a different tribe. Go to a tribe port and talk to their Sifu to change your allegiance. Says you did a great job capturing the outpost. You've earned the privilege of carrying the tribe's weapon. Oh, wear it with pride. Because the honor belongs to the tribe, too. Okay. Out of date says he's doing his best to keep up, but from what he can tell, it seems you're making progress with the tribe conflict. Yep. To why? He had a feeling you'd get along with the Myriad tribe, but it remains to be seen what the future holds for your alliance. I agree. You seem to share the same values as the Myriad tribe. You both have the same optimistic outlook on life. At least, for now. Yeah. But Out of Date emphasizes that solving the tribe conflict won't matter unless you help make a stand against the World Eaters. I know. That doesn't sound good. Out of Date's forebodings are justified. The Jumbo Puff needs to be taken care of. The Jumbo Puff. They have the most ridiculous names for things that the truly are come to like scary. The jumbo puff at the end of the west route. Okay. Gizmo is working on making his mecton strong enough to endure the oxygen-deprived dead zone all the way out to the world eater. Oxygen-deprived? How am I gonna? How am I gonna live through that? I gotta go find Gizmo? You should get over there and see what you can do to help. Yeah. Because if I don't, um, we like totally can't do anything. Yeah. Breathe if there's no oxygen. Ooh. Level up. <laughs> All right. Um. Collect power, key energy, energy region. I don't really care about movements. Let's do melee damage. Oh yeah, so strong. That's what I do the most of. I'm almost a level six. Uh, Cursed Beaver. Circle square. All right, or unstoppable duck. X, X, R2. Huh. We'll do the Curse Beaver. And then... Oh, that was the guns. Oh, come on. Close combat. Now I, now I can't do Bird Swirl. Man! But now I can wear the black leather jacket. Oh, I'm styling. Look at me. 
Look at how cool I am. Uh... I don't have the scrap needed to do anything. Okay, so I can come up here. I can visit their shops. Oh, nice guys! Got a farm going. That's great. Well, it's just kind There's of an empty fighting space. Colors returning to the world. Yeah, have you seen my arm? Oh, hey, Jagney! They're mad now. Yeah, level six! Okay, so I can't jump when I'm in battle. Can't just like jump straight up in the air. Hi. Now that's a flesh wound. What? Got it. Um, hi, people. Oh, my God. I'm so sorry you had to go through this. You're free now. I brightened the world. Interesting. That gave me side points. I thought I was doing that because that's where the, the signpost was, but... Huh, no, it's just a little ways ahead of me. What on earth are you? That's a gnote. Easy prey for Loopa Lupin. For everyone else, they're a perfect mount and easily tamed if they are kept fed. Found a pip plant, glide under it to gather pip seed. You can use pip seeds to tame free roaming mounts. Tame the azure note. Cool. Nice. Okay, so I have to press that um, selected in the transport menu. Okay. Let's not kill him right off the bat. Oh, cool! Good ride long. Tell it, no biting. Okay. So it wasn't a signpost, it was a side quest for me to get a mount. That's a resource totem. A monument left behind by those that picked scrap, trying to right keep up the his area butt. clean. Bash it with your weapon to gather materials for crafting. Yeah, um, can we not? Nice. Some bark wood scrap for you. Oh yeah, I've got to level up. Um, let's do... Uh, vitality because of the armor that's going to help I'm, I'm a melee fighter that's just what I am Oink. it's what I do yeah note it's the chug yard can I get in well maybe not on my note no. The chug yard. Chugga, chugga, chugga. Woo, woo. Chugga, chugga, chugga. 
Okay, so they're like all closed. This knows somewhere inside. Uh huh. So first of all, wow, right up there. We the get one of these. The has posts from those that used to work at the chug yard back in the days gone. They don't make much sense these days. Not much more to say about the board, but Gizmo is holed up in the underyard here working on that mecton of his. The Toxanol Corporation used to run chugger chuggers out of here, <laughs> big machines on rails with smokestacks that fouled the air. People run on those? The rails used to be filled with chugs packed tight with two leggeds, like guppos in a tin. You're okay. on the right track. Keep your... The chug yard. Oh, I can't go in there. Where? Okay, I just need to go around that train. All right. That guy's holding like Nothing's a, a fallout nuke. Right now than this. Close encounter. This box once tailed a chug chug. Now it's just off track. Gotcha! Tribes always scavenging for scrap, and the yard has plenty to go around. But they should have stuck to looting instead of playing around with sprockets. Bomber bonkers busy ram banging the door. This is your chance. Kaboom! Chop it out. Gotcha! Medium energy pack. Uh, tongue tickly. You're absolutely drained. I am now that I, I tried to acid spit on that guy a couple of times. Hey, something to pee on. Let's see. Cool, so Gizmo's around here somewhere. I can pry open the door. Oh, but one. Heroes are only heroes for others. But they do the work, oh. or they're heroes to no one. Oh, you missed him. I was gonna jump over his back and hit him in the back, and then it would look really cool and stuff, and oh my god! How am I not on fire? Yes, you can do anything. The sky's the limit. Now, let's take this back to Earth. Wow, you really took that all the way down to the end. In flames. Yeah! Oh, hey. Nice. Points. Uh, that's why you explore. You never know what you're gonna find. Got me some bio points. It's a wonder some of these up and downs still work. Guess they built machines better in the past. The up and downs. This is seriously like Mad Max Beyond Thunderdome. What's happening, man? Remember me? I need to brush up on my Wando, but I have a feeling he believes it was you that caused the bang at the yard. Yeah. Oh, and he says he knows you. 
You used to call him Gizmo. He gave you the oil-greased hands when he taught you how to upcycle. Uh, yeah, I remember. We just had that flashback. Gizmo remembers you as a nice kidling, and he can still sense the warmth of your good heart. That's because I'm awesome. But Gizmo says how you experience a memory can be different. You know the story, but sometimes the truth it brings is personal. I remember you too. He hopes you remember that one yep. time he taught you to upcycle and hopes you've had some use for it over the years. I have. He understands history made Looper Loop in a big part of your past, your present, and soon, your future. Okay. Well, I value my room. You still believe there's some good in everyone. You still have hope for tomorrow. Yeah. He says you should know that what's meant to be will always find a way, but history shouldn't consume you. I'm ready to forgive. Gizmo encourages that. You should forgive, but never forget. It'll provide some comfort to your soul and keep the memory of lost loved ones in your heart. Yeah, we're, we're going Fire light side. Flame! And that flame, they can get smaller, give it a break. Wait, no! Uh, bright light blinds! It's, it's dangerous! <laughs> I've got all the cold sick burns you need, Dark. Oh, do you have to insult me over this? I don't have to, but I want to. <laughs> You're the light side? Mocking? Hard to believe the world is actually going to survive. Just seemed impossible till now. You guys have given Grateful up. Grateful to you for coming back and doing your best to change things. You were the only chance they had. I don't see why. If you liked working with the Myriad, they always seemed so centered and so seeking. But that's not important now. I agree. Gizmo says it's taken a long time to bring the past up to the present, and where you go from here is up to you. You need to set the past aside, at least for now. He can't I'm trying the to save the future. He has no protection against the vacuum in the dead zone. So you need to salvage scrap to upcycle the mecton, starting with the old crate outside. You should return when you've retrieved the scrap. There's no time to waste if you want to make the mecton strong enough to fight the jumbo buff. Strong enough? There are more crates from before the apocalypse left out in the wild. Easy to find if you keep an eye out. You should be able to gather enough scrap to upgrade the Mecton from them. Okay. The Mecton. Yes. The spent nuclear fuel that Toxanol dumped in the surf had detrimental effects on the marine habitats, while the overflowing landfills contaminated the groundwater. Combined, this sent their world hurtling on an inevitable road to ruin. Yeah, I get that nuclear waste is pretty nasty, but um, the world doesn't look ruined. It looks might as well just dive fine. in that rain and get wet. How strong am I? Oh, okay. I I think it's on like well, whatever. Some kind of rails or something that maybe that was huge. Anyway, that's where we'll stop this one. I want, like I said, I wanted to keep the episodes more manageable. We have found Gizmo. We got our first outpost. We're still kind of in the tutorial phase on things. Um, where does he even live? Hazard zone. Okay. Uh, hazards come in several types: biocontaminated, cryogenic, incendiary, radioactive, and the oxygen deprived dead zone. Here and the resistance, uh, with a resistance of a hundred to a type of hazard, you resist a hundred percent of the damage. Um, I, I want to turn around. Sixteen percent hydropoxia. Tune the ping dish to locate the oxygen suit. I, you know, it's it's fine. Um, I was just exploring a little bit. Anyway, we're gonna save it here. That will be all.
we're, we're still in tutorial phase. We're still learning stuff. They haven't fully explained all the different parts and components of the game. So but these ones will probably be just a little bit, a little bit, and then it'll get to where I have the whole open world and it'll be more like Ghost of Tsushima where I'm doing a bunch of stuff in between episodes to get ready for the actual main storyline. Anyway, leave a like, comment, subscribe to the channel if you haven't already, hit the notification bell so you can see whenever I upload new videos. Links in the description for Facebook, Twitter, and the game. Thank you guys so much for joining me. Catch you all in the next one. Bye!